Hello, hello, folks, and oh, come on, vision. Let there be sight. Come on, come on. The hell? I need to go back in. Whatever. Uh, let me turn this fan off for now. You can hear me? The game, see the game, energy recording, 30, 31, 32. Let us continue. It's been a little bit since, since I recorded. Start map. I see. Kairos was never here. I fear we were manipulated, drawn to Typhon to slay these Eldar. But to what purpose? Well, that's nice. Uh, that's useful, but let's get these. Oh, uh, what was? I see. Kairos was never here. I fear so. we were manipulated, drawn to Typhon to slay these Eldar. But to what purpose? Yeah, this is fun. <laughs> Let's go for this for even more mooks. But no. Not enough uh, space marines have the same resource as orcs. No one else sees title card? Where are you? Show yourself. I am well removed from Typhon, and so needed a puppet there to stop the Eldar and their wretched ritual. Why did it take so long for him to didn't realize he was evil? Traitor, I would rather die. Hmm. Pity, no matter the death you desire is but a moment away. of the God Emperor, our undying Lord, and by the grace of the Golden Throne, I declare exterminatus on the Imperial world of Typhon Primaris. I hereby sign the death warrant of an entire world and consign a million souls to oblivion. May Imperial justice account in all balance. We have 
no choice. Must withdraw. Christ, that's awesome. Be magnificent. To see a planet writhe and scream. To feel it convulse beneath your own feet. Witness it dying with living eyes. In time, perhaps I may share this gift with every last living soul in the galaxy. That, that looked cool. Of course. I will leave it over with you. Think uh, I think there's enough of that. Thanks. Wish there was a select all. Oh, it's those guys. Zone tropes. Zone tropes. I read a cool another. Remember, I read that cool entry from Mundi Four Chan earlier. I read a cool one earlier uh, on what's his face. The I've completely forgotten his name. The you know the one that everyone re re referred. No, not everyone, but I don't want to use that description because it's in case it's inaccurate or not that popular, so on and so forth. Move. Kurz. Conrad Kurz. Um, I read the entry on him before, but it seemed like maybe there's a new entry or a new base that I had, or maybe it was just a bit I hadn't seen. But it's talking about like his death. Like he will, uh, spoilers. Uh, like he willingly walks towards his da his death, and there's a cool bit at the end that for ages, for millennia, the or how, for however long, citizens of the Imperium were terrified of the Night Hunter coming for them, and at long last, Conrad Kurtz came for the Night Hunter. Basically, the Night Hunter was a title held by Kurz, but there's an argument that it was like a—I can't remember the phrasing they used, but basically a split personality. Um, it was two personalities in the one body kind of thing. And. Uh, Artifacts. Um, so yeah, H him leaving the assassin kill him was not a, it was less a suicide and more him finally getting that you know uh, 
finally being able to judge and punish that uh, ooh, teleported me back nice uh, that repulsive side of him or you know alternate personality or whatever I don't know if even it was beyond his reach again the, fra the way it's phrased on the thing just sounds badass Do it. Oh, um, right over here. Over here. Despite you being way for ten, well done for holding up. Chaos people are. are... Oh, nice. They got here at the right time. You're trapped in the arena. Uh, so your aim is quickly to draw it out. Um, go to corn. Hmm. Emperor. Um, I can't get any more. Uh, so I need them fall to corn. I suppose they are soldiers, so it's unsurprising. Hmm. You know, their whole job description falls into corn worship. No, well, um, yeah, yeah. corn likes blood spilling. They spill blood for a job. Yeah. It's, I suppose it's not too surprising, but it's just like I remember someone making a point how they were tired of hearing blood for the blood god, and I'm noticing you don't really hear like even from the uh, well, I ignore Alpha Legion. You don't know what they even want. Um. You always hear blood for the blood god. What even is Zinch's war cry? Is Zinchin's war cry? What is uh, what's the cry of? Oh, not Paris Hilton. Uh, Silnash. What's the war cry, of Silnash? You know, Nurgle. Uh, you, you, it's always blood for the blood god. Skulls for Skulltro. You never hear anything else. Just since they made that point, it's just kind of st it's just sticking in the back of my head, and it's just like, what even is it? <laughs> oh well, and the four and nose. Fight up her forces. Or, sure, why not? They want to.
you. Nice. Snipers. Everyone over this way. The ancient plasma blast, please. Never actually did get to use his artillery barrage. Surprised that still works. It's meant to be like planet bound or artillery. Oh, we apparently don't need to break lure out the other one, we can just leave. But sure, why not? Would this be chaotic? We're spilling... Uh, no, I'm just being overly paranoid here. <laughs> Ooh, I forgot to grab these. Oh, did it lose a guy? I lost the guy. Uh Do it. Yeah. Don't run into it. Knew he killed that guy with it. I get my resources back as I lose, guys. Everyone, please fight this guy. I think I can have both. Yeah, we couldn't do it till that. Armor of the Hunter, Ancient Melter Gun. One, two, three, four. Six, seven. Nearly out of time. Should have done that quicker. Much, much quicker. I'm so. I, I'm a little frazzled. I was trying to make a point in, in my WoW recording there, and I kind of. I forgot what I was saying at one stage. And then just kind of it kind of went around in a circle in my head, which was which isn't conductive. Yeah. <laughs> And so my head is still kind of in that frame of mind. More than I realized. Uh, firing... Uh, first, uh, sorry, Sergeant Paulus of the Red Hunters was renowned for, as the finest marksman in his chapter. He gifted his armor shortly after serving with Cyrus in the Death Watch. <laughs> yeah, he gifted it, huh? Uh... human nature to seek culpability in a time of tragedy. 
It is a sign of strength to cry out against fate, rather than to bow one's head and succumb. Inevitably, many shall fault the hands upon the sword which felled Typhon, the Ordo Malleus. But the Inquisition merely performs the duty of its office. To further fear them is redundant. To hate them, heretical. Those more sensible will place responsibility with those who forced the hands of the Inquisition. With some fortune, they may foster this hatred into purpose, and further rule their own fate by coming to the Emperor's service. Yet ultimately, it was I who set these events into motion. With a single blow from my hammer, God Splitter. It's been a while, but remember the end of. Oh, Judgment of Carrion, we're going back to there. Cool. Uh, remember the end of Dawn of War 1, base game. Yay, sergeants! Planet uh, Typhon Primaris burns, one slush with life, the fleets of Order Malleus have reduced it to a molten inferno. It makes him into a um, assault marine, but I'm using him as um, more of a heavy gunner. It's upgrade you. That'll make the other guys better. Scouts. Sadly, note there's no other upgrades for the honor guard. It's all in the scouts, baby. Sadly. Still, that upgrade for the Honor Guard is potent. Presumably, make up for the lack of any others. Sadly, the effects of this axe is maybe too potent to justify losing. You know? Increased armor, you know, that kind of uh, healing, all that. It's too beautiful. That messes with um, auto attack, so you have to manually target people, which is f fussy. I'm perfectly fine with them just choosing their own targets. In a lot of games, I feel like that's like the better t choice than me having to do it. Ooh, the falling star! Remember, we got the sword of the other guy, the Mertellus, when we killed him. Uh, that just can nuke vehicles. Never used it because we needed an anti chaos weapon. But, Mark target, it makes the scouts better. Uh, in a very good way. Uh, 
Ah, so did they just kind of just teleport blindly off and end up here? Hmm. Stoneheart, purity seal, 350 health and 5 energy. To carry our Emperor's will into the darkness, beyond the Imperium requires vigilance, sacrifice, and the strength to resist temptations of power and glory. That is pretty potent. Could slap it on the Amides there and make him really fucking tanky. Or we can get a literal tank. Uh, I gotta miss the dreadnoughts of the first game. I think they were a lot more gunny. You know? I think they were cooler. That's tempting. But maybe I should get the tanks. Like, what even is that character? This guy. The teleportarium has taken us to the Space Hulk. The judgment of Carrion. Not the safest place in the subsector, but we have our lives. What is our next move? We hold position. Diomedes. What did you say? You heard me. We hold position. I am tired of this hopeless charade. In the end, we are nothing but heretics. Nay, less than that. Pawns of heretics. Puppets. Every century served. Every battle in the Emperor's name. All of it ordered by a heretic. All our glory's lies. There is nothing left to say. No. There is much left to say. And I will break my silence to say it. Sergeant Tarkis. There was another like you, Diomedes, and we served together on Cronus. During the Tyranid invasion, we became fast friends. But Kyrus called for him, and he went. It corrupted him, and he despaired, betraying us to the Black Legion. I slew him. Captain Diomedes, I look to you now and see the same signs. I will not risk that. I will slay Kyrus myself, and if I must, you as well. Our past glories may be lies, but Kyrus has not taken our one true duty from us. No one but the Emperor can relieve us of that. Tarkus. Let us go. We must escape this place. Past records of expeditions to this vessel have reported a teleportarium relay present. If we reach it, we can escape. Orcs. So yes, the ancient Section Sergeant Tarkus. Kind of, you can tell from some of his abilities. But it is an odd title for him to take, the ancient. Also, we aren't worried about radiation anymore. And eh, must have cleared. Sugar, my fine orc. Let nothing stand in our way. I will leave it over with. No, we don't need to rush actually with this one. Unlike their previous timer. But yeah, while it's left on said, the only Uh, the, the only one that would fit, apparently, is Tar is uh, Avatus. He's the only one who would fit. Not, like, everyone else he wouldn't have met during Cronus, or so on and so forth. Um, he's the only one that would fit. They talked about, oh, using line of sight and all this, and I'm just like, Burr. I think these are the same corpses from our previous endeavor. Is 
that'll be on like it previously it won't get the blessed cage or on like that. Uh, so I haven't gotten around to editing these videos just yet. I'm about to start Star Sector. Really home to play more WoW today to catch up on what you know content of fall behind on, but sadly it's on a back, um, not a backlog. Uh, had to come down for an update, so that's annoying. <laughs> 